Hi, my name is Tom Tripp, and I'm the Iwana Director here at Church of the Foothills. And I'd like to share a verse with you I was reading a few weeks back in my quiet time. It's found in Deuteronomy 2.14, and it says, Now the time that it took for us to come from Kadesh Barnea until we crossed over to the brook of Zered was 38 years, until all the generation of the men of war perished from within the camp as the Lord had sworn to them. What I found interesting about that verse when I was reading it is this was the generation that chose not to enter the promised land, not to trust God to get in the battle, yet the Bible calls those guys men of war. And, what, and I think the Holy Spirit was doing a little bit of teaching and what struck me is that these guys were fully ready for the battle, but they weren't willing to get into the battle. And then I thought about, isn't that like us as Christians? We spend our whole Christian life going to Bible study, going to church, studying God's Word, and those are good things. We spend our whole Christian life studying for the battle, but are really unwilling to get into the battle. Awana is a great way for you to get into the battle. Three things you're gonna do in Awana. First, and we'll train you how to do this, is you're gonna get the opportunity to share the gospel with another human being, one-on-one, -on -one, and lead them to a knowledge of Christ. Let me ask you an honest question. When's the last time you've done that? The second thing is in Awana, we're gonna sign you up four to five kids for the entire Awana year, same kids, for about eight months. And you're gonna to get to know these kids. You're gonna love on these kids. You're gonna become their friend. You're gonna root for them. You're gonna encourage them. You're gonna pray for them. You're gonna at times have to correct them. Kind of sounds like what Jesus did with the 12, doesn't it? The Bible has a word for that. It's called discipleship. The third thing you're gonna do in Awana, the kids are gonna be memorizing verses each week, and when they come to club, they're gonna be saying these verses back to you. And you're gonna have an opportunity to, to ask these kids, what do you think that verse means? How would you apply that verse to your life? You know what you're really doing? You're teaching them to do all that Jesus commanded. So three things you're gonna be doing in Awana. You're gonna be sharing the gospel, you're gonna be discipling people, and you're gonna be teaching them to do all that Jesus commanded. You know, if you think about it, what you're really doing is you're fulfilling the Great Commission rather than talking about the Great Commission. Are you ready to get in the battle? Go to the church website and check out the information on Awana, or I will be on the church campus on Sundays from 9 to 12 on the main campus wearing the stylish yellow shirt. I'd love to answer your questions about Awana. You have a great day and thank you.